Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. Rockport Harbor. We're at the marina. Rockport, Texas. We have some color in the sky. There's a few people moving around, not a whole lot. Just a quiet time of the day. One of my favorite things about the harbor is the sound of the flags and the creaking ropes and the water moving against the boats. You can see the Texas Maritime Museum there in the back. That highest peak on the right hand side. You can drive here several times a day and with the angle of the sun get seven different views. Throw in the dogs and the cats and <laughs> the people that come through here. I just find this little drive along the harbor very relaxing. Usually not a whole lot of activity over here until you get around the corner and get to where the bait stands are. Off peak hours in a small Texas community. nice very blessed to have this time I am going to go cook some food before it gets too hot the wind is blowing 15 miles an hour out of the south. So I'm going to try to cook two meals here. Eat one now. And then put the rest in a thermos. And I'll have that later on this evening. Catfish. Have some cheesy rice under there. You can see it a little bit. And dumped on a can of green beans. And I'll just put the lid on top of that. The catfish is already cooked. I'll just leave this on for a few minutes so everything gets nice and hot. Got about 40% of it in this thermos for later. Big old chunks of catfish with some Mrs. Dash lemon pepper and some Mrs. Dash seasonings. Not bad at all. I did put up my uh, cutting board to block the wind. We're all set for dinner later. I'm going to eat this now while it's hot. That's the tailgate cuisine for today. The food's okay. The service is pretty bad. But the views are spectacular. That sign tells you about the blue wave flag and some of the qualifications to get one. I was going to read it to you today, but it's so windy. 15 miles an hour. I already said that. Do you remember which direction? That's right. South. Got everything all cleaned up and put away. 
The kitchen is closed. <laughs> this couple's got the right idea. Sit in the shade. These guys came as a group. There's a few trucks with trailers. They have some buoys set up. Pretty neat. There's your postcard. <laughs> You're welcome. It's pretty neat. Why is everybody running? Oh, pirates. He's getting ready to go back out. I got a joke from my friend Dave. Good morning, Dave. Dave said, why couldn't the green pepper do archery? Why couldn't the green pepper do archery? Because he didn't have an arrow. <laughs> he didn't have an arrow. Thank you, Dave. Dave uh, has a place here in Rockport. Good man, always pleasant to talk to, does community service. Not not even mandatory community service. <laughs> he volunteers. Met Dave and his wife several times, very nice people. Having a little trouble, but he's up, better than me. I'd be floundering around in the water, they'd probably have to get a lifeguard in there. Maybe Greenpeace. I have to go for a little ride and meet my buddy Greg. Just heading out to meet my buddy Greg. I have some things I need to drop off to him. We're actually going to meet at uh, 188 and 1069. That was Greg's suggestion. I don't know if I'm supposed to uh, add those numbers up and convert them to a map coordinate or if we're actually going to meet at the intersection. You remember the uh, the monolift when I went to film it and I sunk down in the mud and got all muddy and almost lost a shoe? That's, that's where he picked to meet. <laughs> Wish me luck, guys. You know, I didn't want to be late meeting Greg. So I met him and we talked for a while, gave him some stuff. And I had to double back to make sure I check on my cow buddies. I must have really upset this guy because he did not want to speak to me. Obviously had other things going on. Whoops, sorry about that, kids. I hit something in the gravel that popped that the cows didn't like. Stick with this one to the end, guys. There's something after the ending. A little outtake. Thanks for riding along today. Thanks for watching.